Hi all, this is Anjali and in this video, I will introduce you to question number 5 of your board exam for class 12 computer science. So question number 5 is in section B. And in section B, we have 3 topics hai, that is SQL, Boolean algebra and computer networks. And this is your question number 5, which is based on SQL. Pe based hota hai. So SQL is a very simple language, hai. it's a non-procedural language. It's very much like English. So, you can learn normal language, you have to know some commands. And then you can write the queries based on that. This is generally a 2 mark question that is based SQL ki theory pe based on SQL. And a 6 mark question that is given to tables. And you have to ask 4 queries to write. You have to ask 4 questions where you have to write SQL code. And in 4 questions, you have to give SQL code which you have to tell your output. Hota hai. So it's generally of this pattern, a little bit of difference can be there. But generally pattern yahi hota hai and it is for 8 marks. It's very easy uh, to score marks in SQL. Agar aap total puri SQL ki videos bhi dekhoge, ek ke baad ek usko samjhoge, tab bhi aapko 3-4 ghande se zada nahi lagenge. So you just need 3 to 4 hours to cover up everything in SQL through my videos and uh, I think एक बार वीडियो देखकर समझ आ जाता है कि SQL कैसे काम करता है। So चार से पांच घंटे आप मैक्सिमम लगा लो कि मेहनत है, लेकिन आपके eight marks शेयर हो जाएंगे कि आपके eight marks तो इस क्वेश्चन में आएंगे ही आएंगे, right? I'm saying five hours including the practice work as well. So that should be more than enough for SQL and it is really good, really interesting and easy to score. ठीक है? So let's see a paper. And just me, I'm dictating question number five. Aapka kaisa dikta hai? So, this is three, four is data file handling, and five is your SQL. So, it comes like this. So, this is SQL. Aap dekh rahe ho, ye fifth question hai, jiska a part two marks ka hai. Jis mein pucha gaya hai, what is the difference between degree and cardinality of a table? What is the degree and cardinality of the following table? That's a very easy question. Degree is a number of columns in a table. Cardinality is a number of rows in a table. That's that easy. So, number of columns is how many? These are vertical wale columns. Hote. So, number, name, salary. Three columns are, so its degree is 3. Two records are, so its John and its Raya. So, its cardinality is 2. It's that easy. And this is very typical hai degree and cardinality. Toh. But it's very easy. Right? So, this is one thing, two marks, ki, easy to score, free ke marks. After this, you have another part of the part hai, question. Ka. Is mein ye table diya hua hai, and they have told you that write SQL queries from B to G and write the outputs of SQL queries from H1 to H4. Query, har ek query is one mark and the output of every question is half mark. Now, there are two tables, one is items and one is traders. Hai. Generally, in both tables, there is a column common. Hota hai. Jaise iske andar aap dekh sakte ho, T code, trader code, yahan par bhi hai, aur T code, <coughs> yahan par bhi hai. So, ye iska primary key hai, aur yahan par ye foreign key ki help se aap isko link kar rahe ho. Agar aapne SQL pehle kabhi nahi padha hai, aapko nahi pata hai foreign key, primary key kya hota hai. So, go through the SQL videos, you will understand it. It's not uh, rocket science, it's very simple. Like, agar ye digital pad 12i hai, aur aapko dekhna hai iska trader kaun hai. So, who is it? T01. T01 is electronic sales. Okay, so we can link it. We are linking it and linking it. But how do you write SQL through SQL? That is what you have to learn in this. So, it's quite simple. And you can see here, these B, C, D, E have questions in which you have to write queries. And then this H1, H2, H3, H4 has queries given. Hai. और आपको उसके आउटपुट बताने हैं और ये तो और भी अच्छा होता है क्योंकि इसमें ना चार क्वेरीज दी होती है तो आपको हिंट ही मिल जाता है ऊपर वाली का आंसर करने के लिए जैसे अब जॉइन है अब आप सोचोगे दोनों टेबल्स को लिंक कैसे करना है जॉइन की क्या क्वेरी याद नहीं आ रही सिंटैक्स में कंफ्यूजन हो रही है कुछ भी कंफ्यूजन हो रही है कोई प्रॉब्लम ही नहीं है जो नीचे उन्होंने क्वेश्चन पूछा होता है उसमें एक जॉइन वाली क्वेरी जरूर होती है जैसे आप ये देख रहे हो यहां पे जॉइन वाली क्वेरी दी हुई है तो सिंटैक्स और जॉइन का आपको यहीं से पता चल जाएगा आपको बस अपनी ऊपर वाली क्वेरी में उसको fit karna hai. So it's simple, it's very easy for 8 marks, right? So aap ko bas kya karna hai? Just watch the videos for SQL. Ek bar saari dekho. Uske baad I will be solving many sample papers and previous year papers. Abhi mein solve karoongi. Kuch already solved bhi hai mere channel par. 
पर मैं और भी आगे सॉल्व करूंगी आई बी सॉल्विंग द सैम्पल पेपर्स एंड ऑल सो आप साथ साथ प्रैक्टिस करते रहोगे कि किस तरह इसे हम एक्चुअली में सॉल्व करेंगे सो जस्ट कीप वॉचिंग दिस बिलीव मी जो मेरी एस टी एल की वीडियोज है अगर आप वो सारी प्रॉपरली देखते हो एंड यू सॉल्व द क्वेश्चन अलॉन्ग विद मी वेन आई डू इट इन द वीडियोज वेन आई सॉल्व द पेपर्स आपको कहीं और से एस क्यू एल को टच करने की भी जरूरत नहीं है नो बुक नो वेयर एल्स यू डोंट हैव टू लुक एनी वेयर एल्स इन यू श्योरली गेट एट आउट ऑफ एट इन दिस राइट सो दैट्स इट फॉर दिस वीडियो एंड इफ यू लाइक द कंसेप्ट डू क्लिक ऑन द लाइक बटन एंड शेयर द वीडियो विद योर क्लासमेट्स ताकि उनको भी ये पहुंच सके और उनको भी अच्छे मार्क्स लेने में हेल्प हो सके सो so, अपना भला भी सोचते हैं और बाकी सबका भला भी सोचते हैं ओके एनी हाउ दैट्स इट फॉर दिस so by the time i upload more keep watching keep learning thank you